we must speak. So, it's time. Are you ready? Yes, I guess. It's louder than I expected. You've never been so close before. I guess everything's bigger up close. Soon it'll all seem familiar. Like home. I don't know about that. Look for High Matriarch Tirsa. She'll help you. Any other concerns? I'm ready to do this. See you back home in a few days? You will not find me there, Aloy. Here. Take this, too. Remember. Why are you talking like we'll never see each other again? No. No! You should be with the tribe. And I will always be an outcast. But I told you, I have that figured out. I'll come to you in secret. I'll be the one breaking the law, not you. You don't even have to talk to me. This attachment to me will only hold you back. It's my wish that you embrace the tribe. You've lived in isolation long enough. Not until now, I didn't. For your sake, I must go where you will never find me. This... This is goodbye. I see. this then it will remind me of you of everything you did and how you helped prepare me for this day thank you heavier than it looks but the cord is strong the old mother bless you Eli Day of all days. I have to keep my mind on the proving. You will turn back, outcast. Or bleed. Your choice. Make way! Make way! Braves, stand aside. She is welcome here. Mother's heart is open to you, child. Come. I assure you, most Nora aren't so rude as those idiots. You're Tirsa? <laughs> Who else would I be? Come on now. I've been waiting for this day a long time. You have? Oh, yes. But for the moment, I must leave you. I have other outsiders to keep safe tonight. You what? Envoys from another tribe, the Karja, come to observe the proving, and oh, how the Nora hate the Karja. Karja? But that's my problem. We will talk later. In the meantime, enjoy the festival. Oh, down the path to the right, you'll find an old friend who can't wait to see you. But I don't know anyone here. <laughs> Try telling him that. We will talk later. May the goddess protect. What is going on? Aloy, isn't it? I'm remembering your name correctly? Are you the old friend Tirsa told me about? 
I don't know you. <laughs> I see you don't recognize me. Well, it was a long time ago. Teb is my name. You were half my size when you saved me from a herd of machines. I remember. You tried to thank me. I never forgot that day. All these years, I hope to see you again, if you came to run in the Proving. As you can see, I didn't turn out to be much of a hunter. I served the tribe as a stitcher instead, a maker of garments and armor. In preparation for this day, I've made an outfit for you. I hope you like it. What's it going to cost? Cost? <laughs> Nothing. Consider the thanks I tried to give years ago. Long overdue. There. Seems to fit you perfectly. Thank you, Teb. I've never had anything like this before. Well, it's yours. I think you'll find it affords more protection than what you were wearing. Every outfit offers some advantage. It's always a trade-off. Anyway, I shouldn't keep you any longer. Head for the Matriarch's Lodge if you want to find Tirsa. You'll know it when you see it. A large wooden building with an angry mob waiting outside. Tirsa said something about envoys from another tribe? Yes, that's what the mob's angry about. Karja visiting our sacred land for the first time in years. I'd expect to see some tomatoes fly, maybe rocks. Hopefully not spears. In any case, be ready to duck. Hello, Aloy. What'd you have in mind? Good luck in the proving. Jog, get down from there. Bad enough, you're drunk. Why do you have to go climbing houses? Listen oh, carefully not now. supposed to go climbing on other people's roofs, huh? Gone. In the beginning, all oh, Aloy, over here. Karst? What are you doing here? Careful. Pretend like we've never met. I wasn't supposed to trade with outcasts in the wilds, remember? How could I forget? And how generous of you to talk to me now. Don't be like that. You know I'll be rooting for you in the proving tomorrow. Can't wait to see the looks on some of these faces when you win. And if you need any last-minute supplies, uh, I'm your man. All right, let's do this. See you later, Karst. Good luck. In a moment, we shall bless the proving. But first, we have guests to welcome. For two years, we have been at peace with Akarja. It is time to restore our bonds of trade with Meridian. These envoys come to us under a banner of peace. Peace, it's peace. <clears throat> An enunciation of gratitude written Jews by the enslavers. hand of yeah. Sun King yeah. of Jews Jews and slavers! Hey, hey, Luminous hold your fruit, nor, uh, nor a faithful. Hold your fruit. Now, I'm Azaram, not Karja, so I'll put it to you straight. The 13th Sun King was a murderous bung. Oh, he was. He was a tyrant and a monster, raided my tribe for blood sacrifice just like yours. My own sister was taken. I hated the Karchas. But the 13th King is dead. Two years now. And who killed him? The 14th. 
Not because he, he lusted for power, but because someone had to put an end to his father's atrocities. Yeah! yeah. The message that this poor priest means to read is an apology. Straight from the lips of the 14th king. So please, can't you lend him your ears? Hey, thank you. <clears throat> An enunciation of gratitude, written by the hand of Sun King Avad, 14th luminance of the Radiant Line. He's wearing a focus, no, just like mine. You're the you. only other person I've ever seen wearing a focus. Where did you get yours? What? A Nora? Wearing one of these? That's impossible. Your tribe fears the old places, forbids them. <sighs> Who says I'm like other Nora? Why, well, yeah. <laughs> I guess you're not. If you've gone delving in the ruins of the metal world. Ah. What's wrong? Apologies. Uh, a malfunction. Oh, Lynn? You making friends with locals, are we? I'll... I'll come back. Wait. No. Uh, we'll talk later. Have to go. Whoa. Well, I guess he's more hungover than I thought. <laughs> hey. You got the same trinket that Olin has on his head. Since when did those become fashionable? His name is Olin? Who is he? And where did he get one of these? Ah, he's just a scrounger with friends in high places. Now he spends half his time digging for artifacts, the other half drinking or dicing. As for the trinket, well, I guess he dug it up somewhere. Just a weird old jewel he sticks on his face. I mean, no offense, it looks great on you. I thought your friend was gonna go down in a hail of fruit, but you really calmed the crowd. Uh, thanks. I, I wasn't sure I could do it. Lenora is still pissed with the Karja about the Red Raids. And who can blame them? I've never seen armor like yours before. You've never seen Vanguard steel? Well, let me introduce you. Ring-locked, impact-protected, sturdy enough to choke a sawtooth. It has to be. The vanguard of the Sun King's best. Life takers and machine breakers to a one. It might even give a Nora war maid like you more trouble than she can handle. <laughs> With all that metal to slow you down? I doubt it. Yeah, hard to say. From where I'm standing, looks like a pretty even match. I should make my way to the blessing. Yeah. Look, maybe I shouldn't say this, but... <laughs> It's obvious that you don't belong in this backwater. I mean, you're smart. You're obviously capable, and... Well, I mean, look at you. Uh, what are you talking about? You know what. All right, if you ever visit Meridian, look me up. I'll show you around, make introductions. It'll be a whole new life, if you want it. I'll even introduce you to my sister. She's got more connections than I do. I thought you said she was captured and killed by the last Sun King. Ha! <laughs> Captured, yes. Killed, no. It takes more than a few cards to finish Ursa. She got away. Now she's captain of the entire vanguard. That's quite a story. Maybe I'll tell it to you sometime over a drink. Anyway, I have to go to that blessing thing, too. So, uh, see you around, maybe? My little sister in their boat. How am I supposed to start the blessing when all aspirants are in place? Aloy, take your place right there. The prayer lantern is yours. I made it for you. <laughs> Blasphemy. Sisters. Aspirants, before each of you sits a prayer lantern 
crafted by your mother. In her honor, light its flame. that takes flight, a glowing flame that climbs the air, set free to the wind, sailing the sky till it fades and falls. So, from one to another, passes the chain of love. There's no one. I have some questions for him. I heard he'll ask for a mate lesson if he wins, but not with his girl, but her sister. Hello, Owen. You know my name. Ah, guess Aaron told you. Why did you act so strange when we spoke earlier? Must be this festival. I'm really not one for crowds. Maybe I should just turn in. Stop dodging my questions. All right, cool your fire. I got nothing to hide. I've never seen anyone else with a focus. Where exactly did you find it? In a ruin, north of the Claim. That's our name for the Asaram homeland. Up there, the metal seams run deep. Steel giants half buried in loose soil. Forgotten caves that the old ones bored into mountain rock. Your eyes just lit up. I found my focus in a cave just like you're describing. A ruin of the old ones. If you've dealt yourself, you know as much as I do. Go to those places for answers. Not me. What are you doing here, Olin? Why come to Noraland? Eren needed a scout for his expedition, and a second for his drinking. That's all. Someone to stop the Sun Priest getting lost. When all this is over, I'm back to delving ruins, rummaging for scrap, scrounging up trinkets to sell. So you're an explorer? Just another Outlander, girl. A man's gotta make his shards. I just make mine in service to the King's court. That's all. When we spoke earlier, you winced, then looked like you were in pain. Or frightened. Did your focus show you something? It didn't show me anything. I told you. It malfunctioned. Happens all the time. Mine's never malfunctioned. And I've had it since I was a child. So yours is in better shape then? I'm sure the land here is full of relics. Seeing how you Nora are too scared to delve the ruins. Because they think ruins are cursed. But I never said I think that. If the North acknowledges a curse, I'm inclined to agree. I don't understand. We have this device in common, but you can't wait to stop talking to me. <sighs> I already have all the friends I need, girl. I don't need to bother. I'm used to being shunned by the tribe. I thought you'd be different. It's nothing personal. It really isn't. You should... try to enjoy yourself tonight. Big day tomorrow. Always best to make every day count. <sighs> Find your bed, outcast, and dream of winning the Proving. That's the closest you're gonna get. Oh, this is the bed house? With you standing guard? I figured it was the latrine. Your... your very presence here!
Well, well. Look who's come in from the wild. The motherless outcast. <laughs> I see you've still got a scar from where that rock I threw hit you. Now that's a cherished memory. You can be a real lard sometimes, boss. Cut it out. Aw, oh, you even try to dress like a real Nora. Not that it fools anyone. So this is how it's gonna be with you, is it? This is how it's gonna be with everyone, outcast. You belong in the wilds, not Mother's heart. And you definitely don't belong in the Proving. You can sense it. You already know you're gonna lose. <laughs> I've trained all my life for the Proving. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of anything. Really? Confidence is quiet. You're not. You know, I often think of the day I gave you that scar. It's a cherished memory. What I remember is how the other children saw that you were a monster. But I suppose you leave that part of the story out when you tell it, don't you? I branded you that day to mark your shame. All you did that day was make me stronger. Just wait. I'll show you tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, right. This is boring. Time for Boss to get some sleep. You'll be the one surprised tomorrow, Outcast. Not me. Oh, are you gonna shut your mouth? Because that would be a surprise. Nice job handling Bost. That should keep him quiet. Till morning, anyway. I don't believe we've met. I'm Aloy. Oh, I know who you are. The competition. The others, they'll finish the proving. Most of them. But win it? That's down to Bost, you, or me. Vala. Nice to meet you, Vala. You're right. I am going to win tomorrow. Never celebrate a victory before it's earned, girl. My mother taught me that. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna get some sleep. I plan to be well rested when I run you into the ground tomorrow. <laughs> Your bunk's right there when you want it. Okay. Thanks. So, your first day in Mother's Heart. What do you think? You've never slept in a Nora Lodge before. Not very private. Comforts and distractions. That's what I think. Not all comforts are bad. Comforts are weakness. You sound just like my mother. You can always go back to living in the wilds if you have to. In the meantime, get some rest. Yourselves. What will it take to get you out of here?
Your trophy is shattered, outcast. Looks like you'll need another. Well, walk from here. Boss will win, Ervala. But you'll be made a brave so long as you finish. Oh, now. That's an old trail. Two died on it last year. It's falling apart. Better dead last than dead altogether. Whoa, 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 whoa. My old mother, are you crazy? You're gonna kill yourself! It doesn't get any easier! You're insane to go that way! That's it. No way but forward Just now. Stop right there. Just turn around and climb. Who's in the lead? I can't see! The ball is at the hunt. Come on now! Faster! Stop dragging! Gotta keep going. The outcast. The old trail? Is she crazy? Good. I'm gaining. The outcast is catching up. How'd she get up there? Made it. Come on now. Hurry. Keep at it. She is a brave now. You did it. As are you all. So long as you put your trophy on the altar. But it is Aloy. Once outcast, and now brave, who is first among us. Ah! Ah!
You're going we down. We can't hold them. Oh, mother, help us. Kill them. Kill the invaders. Quick, run for the slip wire. Kill them all! No witnesses, no survivors! Don't give up! Oh no! There's more! They keep coming! How many are there? Descend while we have a chance. Oh! <gasps> 
Burn it all, then to your task. As you command. Dying. <gasps> to take her there is blasphemy. She should be near her mother. found me before I bled out. But why is no one here? Where am I? <sighs> my clothes. Good. But where's my focus? Jerks are allowed inside. I, I don't see my bow here. Or that damaged focus, the one I took off that. Where are they? I'm picking up some kind of signal. It must be the damaged focus, the one I took from that killer. Close. It looks like the ruins I fell into when I was young. Nora didn't build this place. There. With the rest of my things. and 
proceed at once to the mission point. Avoid all contact with Nora's savages, but if you are seen, kill every witness. Target imaging attached. Do not fail. place where you were born. Are you saying I was born here? Inside the mountain? It is easier if I show you. like me, but with short hair. I don't see how that could be. You were not born of a woman, Aloy. The mountain is your mother. I'm... What? What are you talking about? Come. Great chamber, where all mother slew the metal devil and gave birth to you. Aloy, the Proving Massacre was just the first of many disasters. The war party we sent after the killers was ambushed and slaughtered. But what does that have to do with where I was born? My hope is... everything. This is where we found you. We heard your cries, came to look, and there you were. Just... just lying there? Yes. You mean I came from behind the door? Always, that is what I have believed. That you came from the womb of the mountain. A gift from all mother herself. But others... Like Lansra, feared that a darker power put you here. Not a gift, but a curse. But... This isn't a goddess. Aloy! It's a door. With people behind it. My mother? <gasps> oh. Hold for identiscan. The goddess speaks. Just like the woman I saw. Error. Alpha registry corrupted. Identity cannot be confirmed. Entry denied. No. No.
Aloy, all Mother spoke to you, as if she knew you. Were you not listening? It didn't recognize me. Because of corruption, the Goddess's own words. Surely, if you heal this corruption, she will see you clearly. And how would I do that? You said you've had visions. Of a woman with short hair. The killers came for me because I look like her. But their power is overwhelming. Is there no other trail to follow? Owen. He was one of the outsiders. The night before the proving. The killer saw me through his eyes. He lives in Meridian. So you will have to leave the sacred land. I've been an outcast all my life. Why not an exile too? Shh. There is another way. Come, and we will make it so. You said the tribe was on the brink of extinction. What happened? After the massacre at the Proving, a great war party was sent after the killers. Less than half survived. How was the war party defeated? The killers do not fight alone. Somehow they have a power over the machines, corrupting them, driving them mad. So the killers got away? Yes. And now the only plan my sister matriarchs can agree to is to sing the hymn of atonement and beg for all mother's mercy. As though she would not want us to help ourselves. Then what's your plan? This. This was my plan. To show you where you were born and loose you to follow the destiny all mother intended for you. The other high matriarchs are waiting for us. Let me do the talking. It is done? Yes. I showed her. Sisters, the goddess spoke to Aloy, told her to heal the corruption. Ha! But how is she to do that? She will have to journey beyond our sacred land. A seeker? If the goddess spoke, it must be so. You would name this thing a seeker? Sister! For once, Lanzra, join with us. This will be your sin, not mine. Send her seeking, and may she never be seen again. Aloy, by the holy grace of the One Goddess, we hereby anoint you a seeker of the Nora tribe. No barrier can now stay you from your sacred task. May All Mother protect you and sustain you. Stay true. I will make ready for the hymn. Our hopes lie with you. Tirsa, what's a seeker? You are. And here is your mark. In times of great need, the High Matriarchs may anoint a seeker. A worthy brave sent forth to accomplish a great purpose. No matter where that purpose might take her. Even beyond the borders of the sacred land? Yes. And with the right to return when you are done, or as the need arises. So I can go anywhere at all? No restrictions? Even to forbidden places, like the tainted lands beyond all mother's sight, or the ruins of the metal world. I see. Have there been other seekers? There have, but they are rare, and most who set out are never heard from again. Was Frost a seeker? No, not a seeker. What are you not telling me? This is not the time, Aloy. Perhaps another day. Why are the lands beyond Nora territory called tainted? 
Is it not obvious? Our land is sacred. We live in sight of the one goddess, all mother, source of all that lives. Beyond her sight lies a vast fallen land, spiritually tainted. That is why it is against tribal law to leave. But the Seeker Blessing will protect you. Why are the ruins of the Metal World forbidden? They are blighted places, Aloy. Dark and wicked. Like the children of Metal who built them. When they rebelled and tried to murder All Mother, her wrath leveled their cities, but could not cleanse their sin. Their ancient spite haunts those ruins, ready to ensnare anyone foolish enough to enter them. But... I've been in a ruin. It looked a lot like the inside of All Mother. That cannot be so. It is. Then, this is something beyond my understanding. I will trust you to reveal the truth. What was done with Rost's body? I'm afraid there was very little left to recover. But what there was, we buried at the place where he raised you, with flowers on the grave. Thank you. You said the Nora sent a war party after the killers. Yes, but it was ambushed and overrun. Very few escaped alive, and most that did were wounded. Do you know where the killers went? No, but you could ask Varl, one of the braves guarding the gates of the Embrace. He survived the ambush. He would know more. I should be on my way. From here, you must go to the gates of the Embrace. Speak to Varl, and he will point the way to Meridian. If any Nora tries to stand in your way, Aloy, make sure they know you are a Seeker. Oh, I will. Thank you, Tirsa, for all you've done. May all mother bless you and watch over you. Why are we even wondering? Nora Faithful. The killers must be cards. We will soon we begin. Soon we will God beg forgiveness for the mercy. sins that brought such misery mm. on the tribe. The outcast girl. So she survived her wounds. She saved many lives. The tribe is lucky to have her. I heard the rumors, but I didn't know for sure until I saw you just now. Glad to see you're okay. And you're even wearing the tunic I stitched for you. I'm honored. I should be on my way, Teb. May all mother go with you. Ah, the outcast approaches. Ignore her. Continue to report. There I need the gate opened. <laughs> Since when has any outcast's need been my concern? Since I was anointed a seeker. Now open the gate. You? A seeker? Have Tissa and Jezza gone insane? Bad enough that they let you run in the proving. But to nurse you back to health inside the sacred mountain? No wonder a curse is upon us and children lie dead under cairns of stone. If you think Tirsa and Jezza are traitors, why don't you head up the mountain and say that to their faces? Or do you only talk big when your superiors aren't around? I am the Nora War Chief. And I am a seeker, so do as you're told and open the gate. <sighs> the sooner you're gone from here, the better. What was that?
What you doing to them? You're taking control. Brace yourselves! Kill them, Braves! Kill them all! Braves, ready yourselves! Today we fight a curse! Demon! Won't be long. Gotta get in position. Guts from the carcass. The way it controls other machines. I think I've figured it out. But I need to test it on a machine. Uh, plenty of striders along the path to the gates of the embrace, I guess. Exactly. And the gates are where I'll be headed anyway. I need to speak to Varl. I always knew you were different, Aloy, but. But what? I think you're a blessing from All Mother. No matter what Ress says. Thank you, Teb. But I have to go now. I know you do. And my thoughts go with you. Graves! I want that gate repaired immediately! I need to test this device. See what it can do. 